Well, it's another exciting day, and we are on our next adventure. So, I got a lot more of this flooring done uh, the other day. I didn't film it. I don't know. I just, uh, I just didn't film it. So, I'll show you what I've gotten so far. So, I've gotten it past the fireplace. I've still got to put some stuff between the flooring and the fireplace to get a good nice seal but I got almost all this done all the way over so I just got to finish up this last row along the wall on this door here <clears throat> I could have gotten it done the other day but it was late and I'd already been here for like six hours and I was tired and you know how it is but so that's the plans for today and once I get done with that I'll probably uh work on putting some trim around these closet doors here especially here in this closet on this you know in the hallway here I gotta put some trim up around here this room's filling up quickly as you can see I put this trim up here around this closet door it turned out pretty good I still gotta paint that frame inside of there but that's not a huge priority got a lot of this baseboard put in this room's almost completely done so I'm gonna finish up uh, maybe getting the baseboard put around these corners and go from there but you know we'll see how this goes and uh, hopefully it's a good productive day <laughs>
Okay, <clears throat> all the flooring is done in the living room. It took me a couple days, uh, but it's finally there. As you can see, I got it all up in the corners and up against this door. There's still a slight little gap on this door. It's not that big of a deal, but it's not exactly perfect. And you know, I want to make it perfect, but I got all this done over here. There's a couple extra pieces I had. So what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to take the nail gun and tack the ends of it down so it doesn't shift around and you know, just make it permanent. So that's what I'm going to do now. So I'm going to let this compressor air up for a while because it's kind of loud. So I'm not going to film that. Uh, let's try this out. Oh, I think I ran out of juice. <clears throat> no, we got pressure. <clears throat> huh, maybe I just wasn't holding it right. Huh, I need to figure this out. A nail that's gotten crooked in here. And it looks like I smashed it in there pretty good. There it goes. Let's try this again.
so I got the living room flooring nailed down a little bit. Um, the next step is I'm going to put some casing around this bifold door set to the laundry room where the washer and dryer is. So I got to do the casing around there and then put the trim down there and then there's still a couple little small pieces of trim I got to put down there. But And then I'll work my way around this corner to this pantry closet. And then I'll probably have to stop right there for now, just because, uh, as you can see, there's a little bit of a stack of things that I need to go through or something. But, carry on. baseboard put up. I'm going to call it going to paint it. But I got this trim put up around this door. It turned out pretty nice. I'm going to leave this baseboard off of here for now until I can put the trim up on this door. So that's what I'll do. So doing that trim work and the baseboard stuff doesn't take much time. It's pretty easy, you know, if you got the right tools. But it's done. Looks pretty good. Still got to do the finished touches on it, but you know. Goes around the corner. Got this done up here. <clears throat> so I think the next step is going to be to put some baseboards on this wall in the bathroom try to get it looking nice and good and finished up so there's where we're at now let's see how this goes so that was pretty uneventful wasn't really worth filming <clears throat> but I got the baseboard put up in here. It's a little bit uneven right there. There's just a little gap because the floor is a little bit bowed. The floor was tricky to say the least. But I got the baseboard put up around everything. So now we just need to get a mirror in here and get some outlet covers. And this bathroom should be just about finished. That'll be exciting. On to the next project. So where the flooring meets the stone at the fireplace, it's not level at all. So you can see there's some gaps in there. <clears throat> it's not big, but I don't like that gap. It's just a place to collect dirt, and debris, whatever. So what I'm gonna do is take this self-leveling polyurethane sealant. Basically, it's made to fill in cracks in concrete but it's self-leveling and I think it'll make a good seal up against that stone. So we'll see how that works out.
Well, that was a whole tube of sealant. I've got one more. You know, I'm sure I'll have to buy some more, but here's what we're going, working with so far. As you can see, it's sealing up pretty good around there, around the base of these rocks. I need to clean this vent off really bad. I know you can see it on the camera. Don't worry, it'll get taken care of. But there's what I'm working with so far. Once that stuff dries, I'll be able to put a little bit more on there because it still has a little bit of a dent to it. But I'm going to keep going through here and use the other tube, see how far I can get with it. sealant I was using. I only had two tubes of it, but I'll have to get some more to finish up what I was doing. But as you can see, it's a uh, it's sealing up pretty good. Then once I uh get some more tubes, I can get that all finished and get it cleaned up and looking real nice. But uh, with that being done or with me running out of them tubes, I think I'm going to call it a day. It's getting kind of late in the afternoon, and I'm getting hungry. I miss my daughter. We'll see her. And uh, it's a good stopping point, so uh, I'm going to go ahead and stop. So I hope to be back. I don't know if I'll be able to make it down here tomorrow, because I don't think anybody's going to be able to watch my kid, but I'm definitely going to come back on Friday. Today's Wednesday, so I'll, I'll, I'll be back here on uh, Friday to... Uh, Hopefully finish getting that stuff wrapped up and then put some more baseboard down and get some more of this house knocked out. But, uh, it's coming. I'm getting there, slowly but surely. So I hope you guys are still interested in what I'm doing. Because even if you're watching or not, I'm still going to be working and I'm still going to be trying to make these videos just, uh, more, more of anything just for me and, you know, people that I know to to share the progress of this house because you know it's been this house has been a part of my family for 20 years now and it's long up due for a update so <clears throat> I'm doing the updating so I hope everybody has a good day and I'll catch you next time